Hello everyone and welcome to the finale episode of SPL Social, the show just about the Singapore Premier League. And as you all can see, we are in a very special place today. We are, you know, away from the place that we usually go to because we are here to celebrate the end of the season and also celebrate the traditional Singapore dish, which is chicken rice. So we're here at Rex Chicken Rice Shop in Mackenzie Road. So, you know, thank you for having us, of course, guys. And I'm, of course, joined today by two amazing guests. But also, you know, we have fans joining us as well today for the very first time. And of course, I want to introduce you guys to my two guests. Firstly, the players who have joined me, you know, a player who has made a mark this season in the Singapore Premier League with Alberex, you know. And I'm so, you know, very happy to have him. Kodai Tanaka as well, Alberex Nigata. And thank you so much, Arigato, for joining us again for the show. Thank you so much. Yeah, and also we have Raihan Rahman, of course, you know, from Tanjung Pagar, who has also had an amazing season of Tanjung Pagar because, you know, in the beginning they were doing really well. And I have to say, you know, now it's also one of the more impressive sites as well. So thank you so much, Raihan, for joining me today. And as you can see on the corners of the table, we also have two fans who have, you know, been a part of SPL Social. They have, you know, commented on the post, they have, you know, engaged. So I'm very happy as well to have Muhammad Anaki. Whom, as you guys may know on social media, he's always doing videos and you know, a very big fan of Singapore football. Thank you, Anaki, for joining. On TikTok. Yeah, on TikTok, that's right. <laughs> Not on Facebook, but we'll see you a lot on social media. And oh, we also have um, Amir Hamizan as well, who is from the Swan Army, which is a big Albrecht uh, Singata, you know, fan club, right? Yes. So we can't wait to hear more about them. So let's start, you know, firstly with the food. Okay, guys, let's, you know, get into the chicken rice today. I just want you guys to enjoy. Of course, today we have. Um, I think uh, roasted chicken rice, um, you know, which is a traditional dish. I want to ask you, is this your, have you tried chicken rice before? Kodai? Ah, yes, yes, yes. Who yeah. did you have chicken rice with? Uh, Masaya Hidetsu. Yes, your teammate Masaya who yes. has been, I think, also amazing. I think Masaya is also a very good player yeah. with his set pieces. So yeah, I mean, I hope you enjoy your chicken rice, guys. So please uh, tuck into your, into your food now. Um, yeah. Just start eating. It's fine. <laughs> so guys, um, while we are speaking, right? Um, Kodai, you can you can eat. Yeah. <laughs> Arigato. Okay, Raihan, for yourself, let's start um with you. I mean, Tanjung Baga finished six in the table, mm. right? Um, but you have to say that they started out very strong, you know. Yeah. Um, you know, you guys fought really hard. I would say also the fans came out. So how do you feel generally about the performance of the team this season? Yeah, I think. Uh, at the start of the season, I think we did really, really well. And definitely in football, there's always bumps here and there. So, our focus now is in RHB Cup. And we'll make sure we'll do our best for the Cup and see whether we can be champions or not. That's our target there. Okay, Kodai. Congratulations on winning the title. I can see, you know, the medal around you. How do you feel about winning the Singapore Premier League with Albrecht? I'm, I'm very happy to get the champion. First of the season, it was lit, it was little hard to get the win. But we fight hard on the each match and got champion. Kodai, your English has improved, so. It's better than the last time with Ilhan, you know. Do you remember the episode, the sushi one? When you ate the sushi, yes. That time it was, I can see the improvement. So congratulations. Um, okay, um, Raihan, let's go back to you now. Um, I just want to ask you, you know, Tanjung Baga has some impressive players in the team. In Alam Shah, you know, is in there. You have legend Kairu Amri as well. Your coach, Hasbin Jalani. Big names in Singapore football. What is it like playing under them and also with players like this? Uh, playing... Under Noah Lamsha, Coach Ashrin, uh, we got Hafiz O, we have uh, Coach Indra Shadan, we have who else? Uh, Fajar. Yes. Uh, they have a lot of experience, and I think without uh, Along, Along is uh, Coach Alamsha, I think without him, I don't think like half of us. It is like we are that good. We don't know that we are that good. If without him, we don't know that. And I think uh, like this year, I think everyone knew that my delivery was was better than before. And it all, you know, it all because of Noah Lamsha, uh, like I said. And playing with legends like Ambri, Daniel, I think it will bring more stability. It bring a lot of experience in the changing room. They will guide us through. Uh, especially difficult times 
like the last round and the third round especially. So I think with them, it, it, it brings a lot of different dimension rather than all the same age and the younger ones. Yeah, definitely I think having players like that is a, quite a motivation for you guys. So, I mean like you said, good luck for the Cup. Singapore Cup is still coming up, so we wish you the best with that. Okay, Kodai, I want to go to you now um, because today we have two fans joining us and I know fans are very important for, for Alberic. So how do you feel um, about the uh, fan support from Alberic and, yeah, and Singapore fans? They have big passion. I thank them very much. Yeah. Raihan, you know you have a teammate, Ryo Nishigushi, who um, speaks very good Malay apparently. Like you yeah, taught very him good. very good Malay. <laughs> yes. So I wanted to clarify one word. Throughout the season, everyone has been asking me, is it like Sapu Lagi? Was it Sapu Lagi? Okay, yeah. it's supposed to be Siapa Lagi. Okay. But Ryo apparently mentioned Sapu Lagi. So <laughs> Sapu Lagi is actually sweeping. So oh. if you want to learn Malay, come to Tanjung Paga, okay? <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Is Ilhan teaching you Malay? No, no. no. Ah, so that's why come to Tanjung Paga. <laughs> <laughs> Malay and English. Can you can you teach him some words in Malay? Good one. Good one. Sedap? Lazat, lazat. Sedap. Sedap? Yeah, sedap. sedap means good. Very can nice. I, can you say sedap? Oh, sedap. Is it? Lazat atau inak? Oh. Arigato. <laughs> Kodai, you don't take chili with your food? No chili? No chili. Okay. Okay, wow. That's amazing. Okay, now I want to go to the fans. Since you're talking about fans, um, let's start with you first. Um, you know, you've been a fan of um, Albrex for a while. So, how does it feel for you being here, part of SPL Social, with one of the best players, I would say, this season in, in the league and also Albrex as well? Okay. I think it has, it has been a long way since uh, 2019, where I started as one army. And it grows over time. Uh, and it has become into a big family, which uh, the club, the fans, and even the community has a very uh, tightly knitted um, uh, what call it, uh, stool in the club, where we were, we were able to cheer on our our football club, um, no matter is it a win loss or no. Yeah. So how do you feel about Alvarex winning the title? You remember that was one game, one intense game on the, the on the final, I which could I scored as well. Yeah, so, a hat trick. Yeah, yeah <laughs> fantastic. Okay, I feel uh, it is one of the most satisfying titles that we won. I mean, I watched them won five titles, all five. Uh, but against Sailors, it was like um, an impossible task with the massive uh, facility and the amazing thing they have, they have done to Singapore football, bringing in stars, uh, international footballers into the country. And for us, we, we followed uh, Kazu, King Kazu's um, I would say, uh, passion, being together as one family, no matter you are the staff, the players, the fans. We win together, we laugh together, we smile together at the end of the day. Yes, that's why it was... I, it's, it's the best title that I, I felt we won. Uh, yeah. Ah, okay. Alright, Anaki, I'm going to go to you now. Um, big Singapore football fan, like I said. So, how are you feeling today, you know, being on this table, on this show with a player like Raihan as well? So, initially, I thought Cairo Amli would be coming today. So, but it's fine. Uh, Cairo Amli get well soon. Uh, but it's fine because uh, uh, Raihan Rahman here, who was one of the players that I looked up to last time when I was a young kid, mm. especially during the Lions of Era. So I, I brought the bag with me. Yeah. <laughs> like so I want your signature later. This is Fandi Ahmad's uh, signature. <laughs> so, so basically, yeah, Ra Raihan was one of the players I look up to. So it's good having him beside me. And what? it's like, yeah. it's, it's a flex to, to, to my friends that I'm, have, I'm eating chicken rice with them. Especially, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Tanaka, yeah. So, so wait, what did you like about Raihan uh, when you first watched him play? Last time you. When I was 8 years old, right? to be honest, I just find him handsome. handsome man. <laughs> <laughs> At first, it was Paris Ramli, Karul Ramli, after that, it was like number 16. Anaki, okay. No. Number, number 16. Hey, I'm right. scared now, man. <laughs> handsome, quite handsome. Yeah. No, you mentioned all those names. You mentioned Sharil Isha as well, Karul Ramli, yeah. Sahil, now Raihan as well. Yeah. Okay, and for yourself, because you no, know, we are here with Kodai as well. I'm sure you followed the SPL, right? How do you feel about you know the entire season as, as, a, as a Haogang fan, I believe, right? To be honest, it was a very entertaining season. There's a lot of saga and everything. And especially, uh, one of the matches that was very iconic was uh, Haogang against 
Albi Rex, the 3-3 one. Uh, yeah. uh, who was the, who scored the last minute free kick? Uh, Masaya Idetsu. Ah, Idetsu, right. <laughs> when he scored that free kick, I was like, no way, he could have won it, but fair play to that free kick. It was, it was a beautiful yeah. moment. It was a beautiful yeah. free kick. You know, I want to ask you, right? I know we cannot talk about this, but you know, there has been some controversy during the season, right? Um, I mean, obviously, I'm not going to name exactly which um, it, it is, but you, as a player, right, sometimes you do get quite heated up in the moment, right, during this... Yeah, uh, it's always when when the games are in, is intense, this type of thing will happen. And for me personally, uh, whatever happens on the field stays on the field. So I'm not gonna say anything much about about the last game. Hopefully, it will be settled as soon as possible. Okay. Yeah. And Raihan actually is known as one of the more popular players when it, when it comes <laughs> to these issues. But it's not a bad thing though. I think we all love the game. We all want the best decisions oh, yeah. for the game. And speaking of decisions guys, there's some big news about the Singapore Premier League. That VAR is coming to the league next season officially. Video Assistant Reflect Technology. So I want to ask you Kodai, you know you are up there scoring the goals. How important, how do you feel about VAR coming to the Singapore Premier League? It's a good thing to say. VAR is... その審判レフリーもジャッジできないところをジャッジしてくれると思うんで、そこはすごいいいところだと思います。エンコダイミサイズ、ビーアル、ワンアンドエンプルーブメンツ、ユーティングニットビーメイクトアウリー。ああ、
and the net and the local football itself. Okay. Could I? Okay, you know you've done so well this season. Many people are asking, what are your plans? You know, I'm sure there are many teams that want you. Tanjung Paga is one of them. Raihan has invited you, so you're always welcome to come. But you know, what 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 are your plans for next season? I haven't decided yet. It. So we should focus on the Singapore Cup. Okay, and speaking speaking on the Singapore Cup, Alvarex, you know, are you guys out to win the Singapore Cup also? Of course. You know, I was going to tell him to give chance to the other teams in the league, but <laughs> but it's go it's it's okay. I think it's 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 good, I guess, you know, to have this kind of level of competition. But you know, Raihan, this brings me to to you. I want to ask you: Do you think like more teams in the SPL will help our game? Because currently we have eight teams, right? And a lot of um, fans are saying that they would like to see more teams. Do you think it will it will help you guys? Yeah, definitely. I think uh, because now we are playing four rounds, right? Yes. So I think with more teams, I think it will be much much better. I think uh, injuries will like four rounds. I think there's a lot of injuries through all the clubs, and I think with more teams, with three rounds, I think it will help the players also. So yeah. Okay, I mean, um, I'm going to ask you as well. Um, besides um, Kodai, who has impressed you with Alberex this season? I mean, we, we talked about Masaya, Ilhan. They've been fantastic as well. I mean, for you, is there any other player? For me, okay, for me it has to be someone like. Kito Haria, Kapunta Kupi, even Ryo Kunimoto, those uh, at the back, those who are actually holding the, uh, the fort and also doing the unsung work. Like, even if we have Kodai, if we don't have Kito, Kumbe, uh, breaking up the midfield and sending the ball up front, he won't score as 32 goals. <laughs> Great stuff. I think it's important to also acknowledge the other players in the team. So we're going to go to fan questions. So again, and Spill Social is about the fans. Thank you so much to everybody who is sending their questions. And you know, we hope that we can make you happy because we've got a lot. So I'll try my best to ask. Koda, I've got a question from Kaya Britt. What is your favourite goal oh. of the season? My favourite Very goal. difficult. It's against Serat on uh, September. From... Uh, Left side, cutting, shoot on right foot. I remember this one, huh? Good goal. <laughs> okay, that's your favorite goal. Okay, Raihan, I've got a question from that's a Tina, right? So who is or what is your is your biggest motivator? Biggest motivator, I think my partner, my daughter and my family. I think they are the one who is my biggest motivator. They keep you going. Yeah, they keep me going, they keep me grounded. <laughs> They and keep me every, do everything lah, yeah. to be honest. Yeah. And family is very important, yeah. Family yeah, is very football, important, yeah. yeah, family as well. Okay. Another question from Ibrahim um, Secondary School 2022. Um, do you want to play in Malaysia? I think everyone wants to play in overseas, right? Uh, if I have an opportunity to do it, I will. If I have a trial, I will do it. Even if whatever comes, I will still do it. Especially in overseas. I will just want to try my best because I think Football career is very short. We have to take the every opportunity that we get. So yeah. And speaking of opportunities, um, Kodai, baked pie stand. She wants to know what is one lesson you have learned from this season. Nihon hanarete, sono ichi ne daitai ichi nen kan zutto Singapore ni irun desu kedo. Sono naka de, ma, kankyo mo chigau naka de, doko demo ten ga toreru っていうのは Okay, Kodai, another question from Ray Souza. It's a fan from Brazil. You got fans from Brazil, okay. <laughs> you know the World Cup is coming up, but I mean of course it's a big goal. Do you do you have you know plans to play for the national team one day, you know, and perhaps go to the World Cup? I know this is a big question, but what, what is your biggest uh, goal for yourself? <laughs> いや、もう今は目の前のそのことに集中したいんで、ま、これからの先のことはこれから考えようかなと思ってます。But it be really cool if he breaks the Japan national team one day, you know. Okay. Raihan, okay, I'm going to I uh, have to ask the fan questions, but I want to give you guys a chance to also ask what you would like to ask, but let me just go ask one more question to Raihan. Okay. Uh, Raihan, um, you know, you I need to ask you as well in this entire season, right? From not now foul, he or she wants to know who has been your standout player for this entire season? Could be from your team, could be from yeah. Favorite player? Okay, uh, to be honest, I don't really, I don't watch football, 
from from the SPL. Yeah, I don't oh, watch football. Okay. Uh, but I think this year, I think this year Rio had a very good season. Blake has a very good season. I think Kodai. Kodai have a very good season. But who impressed me a lot? I think Shah Shahiran. Ah. I think Shah Shahiran. Ah, uh, I think he had a very good season, and he breaks into the national team. Uh, and I think he will be there for a very long time. So. Thanks for that, Anaki. I'm going to give you a chance now to ask Kodai and um, Raihan what, what you would like to ask. I would like to ask Raihan first. So, <laughs> Go for it. I, would, I, would, I would like to know what was your peak in local football in Korea? Peak? Yeah, like the best part of the career in local football. In local football? Yeah, I have an answer in my mind already, but I don't know. Oh, about answer you. in your mind already. Yeah. Oh, lo local football in SPL? I mean, national it, team, last oh. time. Uh, no, I think. Ah, it will be in Lions Shop. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think it will be in Lions Shop. I'm not sure what year. Uh, I think 2015 or 2016. I think that's where I make my I break into the first team, and that's where I think I make my name. I had a very good season that, uh, but sadly I got injured at the end of the season, and then I have to go back. Oh. Then that's when you pay for Hougang United right after that. Uh, yeah, I went to Haugang, then I went to uh, Balestia, then I go to Tanjung Paga. So, yeah. And I ha I'm very happy at Tanjung Paga. <laughs> he wants to clarify that he's very happy at Tanjung Paga, guys. Okay, okay and any, any other questions you'd like to ask uh, Kodai? Kodai Tanaka, right? I want to know, what was your feeling like when you were one goal away from the Golden Boot? Two, two, two goes away, sorry, sorry. Yeah. From Boris, Boris, yeah, yeah. It, it doesn't matter because we get champion. <laughs> it's the savageness for me, okay, yeah. Okay, and Amir, for yourself, would you like to ask, um, you know, Kodai or, or Raihan any question? Well, Raihan, what was the feeling to score a goal direct corner in a professional match? <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, I'm going to tell you uh, honestly. Okay, before that corner was taken, I already said to the boys that okay, go inside to the six yard box or nearer to the goalkeeper. So my target will always be my players. Yeah. But with a little bit of luck, he went in straight. Wow. And he looks to go. I myself was shocked <laughs> because after I kick it, I walk away. So when I walk away and I saw the ball went in, I was like, oh okay, celebrate. Yeah, it was like under two, like you weren't expecting it. Yeah, I didn't expect anything. So I thought it was because Faris was the nearest. Uh, Faris was the nearest, so I thought Faris got a touch, but he went in straight. So it was lucky. I'm not gonna lie, it was lucky. It was really, really good day for me, like. <laughs> good day. Yeah. But it was a draw. Yeah. Yeah. It was a draw. Yeah. Did Did you practice for that? Uh, okay, for corners, uh, we did practice. I did uh, day before game. I will always yeah. do, but to do that. Uh, oh, that's luck also. Yeah, that's luck. Uh. It's definitely luck. It's yeah, definitely luck. It's better than a different level. Yeah. You've got a question for Kodai? Kodai, for me. Who assists better? Masaya or Ilhan? Yeah. Masaya. Yeah. Oh. yeah. That's your answer there, Masaya. Like I said, the king of set pieces. Like, he's just so good at set pieces. And he did say as well that he models that his set pieces um, over David Beckham, so it's quite interesting as well. Okay, guys, um, you know I think we have a couple of minutes left, but you know I just want to get your rallying call for Singapore football fans out there. So I'm gonna start with you first, Amir, because you are there at every game supporting Alvarez. So what do the, do the fans need to do? You know, perhaps to give Singapore football a chance, especially those younger ones. Yeah. Come to the stadium because you watch those Man United, you watch those Man City, Liverpool, Arsenal. You're not there in the stadium. And the most important thing, the fans like Raihan, Kodai, will acknowledge you, will play their hearts out for you. Because I know Cristiano Ronaldo is a big star, but does Cristiano Ronaldo thank you for your handshake after the game? I don't think so. Only SPL. Oh, wow. That was a great rallying call, Amir. I, I think that's true. You get a very up close and personal experience with your local players. 
Could I, you know, I know many Singapore football fans know who you are now, but do you have a message for, for them? Thank you for your support. Please come our match. <laughs> Okay, yeah, we still have a couple of matches left in the Singapore Cup, so do go on, go on to the stadium. Okay, Raihan, for yourself, I would like to hear your, your message. The Tanyo Paga fans, I think we would love for you to come to support us uh, for the last few games. Uh, RHB Cup, I think with full force, I think with your energy, I think it gives us a lot of energy. I think we, we need your support at this period of time. and. Uh, we will try our best to make sure that we reach the final and to the rest of the fans, please come and support your local team. Uh, I think it means a lot to us and to them and hopefully to see you guys in the stadium. And now I leave the final rallying call for someone who calls himself SG Football Fans. I've been waiting for this moment and I'm sure he is as well. So can we get your rallying call for Singapore Football Fans? So, uh, to the Singapore Football Fans in Singapore, one word for you guys is trust the process. And if you're not uh, watching the local league, try to because tickets is very cheap. For adults, $10. For children, for people under 16 years old, it's only $5. So it's very cheap, okay? And lastly, lastly, right, if, if, you, do, if you don't watch the local, the local league, try to. Okay? If you live in Tampines, support Tampines Rovers. If you live in Haugang, support Haugang United. If you're a Glory United, never mind, I don't want to say it. <laughs> so just watch the local, the local league. Even though it's not making progress, just trust the process because one day it will be as successful as the Premier League. Yeah, can we get a round of applause for Anaki? And also for everybody who has joined me today, Kodai, Amir, Raihan and you. Anaki. You know, thank you very much as well to Rex for having us. And I just want to say as well to everybody who has supported us in the entire SPL social season. Every single player and every single team who's been on as well. There's too many to name but you guys know who you are. And yeah, thank you for saying chicken rice is the best dish. And yeah, I mean thank you to everybody as well in um, the FAS for supporting this show. And of course, do stay tuned to next season because I'm sure it's going to be a very exciting Singapore family. I'm Ash from Footballita and I'll see you guys next time. <laughs>